Hi everyone, this is Dr. Pravin S. Patli here. Today I am going to demonstrate abnormal paracentesis, which is also called as a peritoneal synthesis or laparocentesis. It is a simple bedside procedure in which the needle is inserted into the peritoneal cavity and aseptic fluid is removed. A diagnostic paracentesis refers to a removal of small quantity of fluid for the testing, whereas a therapeutic paracentesis refers to removal of 5 liters or more of the fluid to reduce the intra-abdominal pressure and the relieve the associated dyspnea, abdominal pain and early satiety. Any volume removed greater than 5 liters is considered as a large volume paracentesis. Here I am using jet tracking technique which held particular importance in the performing the paracentesis. A jet track is a technique that allows for decreased acidic fluid leak followed by the paracentesis by displacing the needle track with respect to the epidermis and the peritoneum. So if possible you can slide the skin over that if in case of the over distended patients which is not possible to slide the skin in those methods in those conditions we suppose to follow the Z tracking technique. So the inserted the needle is inserted in one direction initially and later on the direction has to be changed and then it has to be entered into the peritoneal cavity. Abdominal paracentesis is indicated to relieve the abdominal pressure from the ascites or to diagnose the spontaneous bacterial peritonitis and other infections like the tuberculosis and all, to diagnose the metastatic cancers and to diagnose blood in the peritoneal space in trauma cases. So this is about the small introductory video about the abdominal paracentesis. If you like this video then kindly subscribe to the channel and press the bell icon. Thank you, thank you one and all for watching my video.